a lot of people don't realize it, but you are critical to this modern world, you know, without energy, the whole world will come to a stand still, you know, it would exist. But then there is a lot of uh, transformation going within the energy sector. And that transformation is also because the way we are consuming, the way we are like actually, every consumer because of solar, everything is also becoming a producer. EVs and all those things are changing the flow of electron. We are also looking at sustainable sources of energy. And I want to bring it back to security also means the sustainability of the source code of the software also, you know. So I want to tie these two, two things together. And I want to ask you, if you look at the larger picture, how does sustainable open source, you know, can also ensure our sustainable future when we do talk about this energy transition. As you said, uh, the renewables are uh, changing the whole landscape in terms of energy distribution, the business we are in. We can no longer take energy from power plants and just distribute it as is. We have to deal with uh, uh, energy that is uh, weather dependent and it's coming from all places, right? Uh, households are generating energy and consuming at the same time, businesses, everybody. and. So we have to enable uh, the, the proper sharing of energy, not only through cables, but also the digital infrastructure to enable uh, the, the markets, the coordination mechanisms. And um, for us, that means a lot of digitization, and, but that means that all the other parties, uh, whether these are businesses, whether these are consumers, have to, or maybe not have to, but ideally should participate in uh, digitizing and getting active in uh, optimizing steering this, uh, this, this weather dependent fluctuating energy. So I see a lot of opportunity for standards, for software packages that all uh, everybody can, uh, can, can implement and adopt to make this better to, uh, and, and to work with, uh, to, to make this practical. So uh, for example, we have OpenStaff in the LF Energy project, uh, in the LF Energy Foundation. OpenStaff is about uh, predicting energy locally. Of course, we use this as a grid operator, but a business can use this, even a consumer can use this. It doesn't matter uh, because the software is rather small in terms of footprint and is really reusable. Um, so this is one example. We also need standards to uh, uh, interoperate and communicate about all this uh, yeah, energy usage.